assalamu alaikum friends my name is muhammad yunus in this video i am going to uh, discuss how easily we can uh, update the quantity on hand of multiple products uh, in, in a bulk so for this purpose we will use inventory adjustment and um, so let me check the udo version so this is uh, currently we are using udo version 13 community edition so let me check here so that you can see and we will use inventory adjustment for this purpose uh, so let me go to the inventory adjustment module uh, this is here so let me show you uh, we have created these three products uh, in and we will update the quantity of these three products uh, by just importing an excel file so if there are uh, less products like two three four ten products then you can update it manually but if there are uh, thousands are um, 100 products then it is really difficult for you to update the quantity manually one by one so you can use inventory adjustment easily for this purpose uh, to update the quantity so under the inventory module you will be able to see the option inventory adjustment so click inventory adjustment and click any uh, inventory adjustment record so here you can add anything like uh, uh, update uh, quantity on hand and then you will have to select here allocation so we want to update it for your house um, stock and uh, here if you want to update for some specific product so you can select it here but if there are multiple products then you don't need to select any product here and keep this as empty so uh, here there are uh, two options counted uh, quantities are uh, default to stock on hand so it will show um, on hand quantity on the uh, other screen and if you set it uh, default to zero then it will show a uh, zero as uh, uh, stock on hand so let me choose the first option and then uh, click start inventory so once we click start inventory we will uh, see this uh, screen so here um, you have uh, two options either select the product manually and add the quantities uh, and the next second option is to uh, export these uh, records uh, like for example I want to export these records and then um, prepare the excel file and then import again so let me download the format and uh, click to open up here so let me select uh, this all and then delete it delete and this is it so here we will have to add the product name and then location and then uh, lot number so we don't have the lot number for this product so we don't want to import the theoretical quantity and we don't want to import a uh, difference so here we will have to add uh, the product name so let me copy it from here uh, so don't select it so let me unselect it and then open it uh, one by one so this is the whole um, product name that you need to select uh, and put it here like this so duplicate it and then uh, add the product name here like two and then here it will be two and then make it three and then edit three so you can use this uh, excel format to import the inventory adjustment and then uh, let me copy this to also and here we will have to add the quantity that we want to update so for this product we want to update 10 and for this product we want to update 15 and for this product we want to update 20 and let me and copy and paste this location here also so let me save this uh, excel file which is stock dot uh, inventory dot line three and uh, let me go to this screen so here you can see the import button so click the import button and select the file which is this one so after selecting the file you will be able to see this screen product uh, that has been selected here this is the location and these are the quantity that we want to update so here you will have to first click the test button to check if everything is working fine and then click the import button to update the quantity so this is it uh, we have updated the quantity for these products and then uh, click validate button to update the quantity uh, in Odo. 
so uh, let me go to this and uh, refresh this page so here we can see quantity and hand has been updated for these three products so this is the simple way that you can update the quantity on hand for multiple products uh, in a single import so thank you guys for watching this video if you uh, like this video please give a huge thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet so please subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon so you can get the updates of the upcoming videos. Thank you.